Pontia City Police have launched a real-time analysis of crime in the area utilized through digital mobile phones and AI technology. Let's tell you more about it. Thanks for joining us. I'm Adam. This is TPI Media on the 10th of May of 2025. Now, Pontia City Police Station has taken this step along with the help of Region 2 Police, which is basically all the eastern provinces, by developing a real-time crime analysis system accessible via mobile phones, dubbed the Digital Crime Clock. This also utilizes technology such as AI-powered facial recognition, which is already in use to identify wanted individuals and monitor potential criminals, enhancing overall efficiency. According to the Deputy Chief at the Patia City Police Station, he told our reporters that the Digital Crime Clock is designed to boost the effectiveness of crime prevention and suppression. Now, essentially, this system provides real-time crime data displayed on mobile devices, enabling what they call precise and timely decision-making. Previously, crime incidents were actually manually plotted on a physical board and paperwork. Now, details of incidents such as theft or assault, including dates, times, and locations, are all digitized, finally bringing us into the current century. According to the deputy chief, he cited a practical example. For instance, recently, there were frequent assaults that were reported along Patia Central Beachfront, including by us. By analyzing data through this digital crime clock, police identified peak incident times, such as 3 a.m. to 4 a.m., and deployed additional patrols accordingly. This targeted approach, according to the deputy chief, reduced assaults in the area, proving this system's real-world impact. Now, of course, this is not intended to replace the police, but instead to provide a comprehensive overview of crime patterns, helping officers identify when and where specific crimes occur and allowing for more accurate deployment of preventive patrols. The Patia City Police Station is the first in Region 2 to implement this system, setting a precedent for crime analysis and prevention planning. However, it eventually is planned to be expanded to other provinces in the Eastern Region. Now, as head of crime prevention and suppression at the Patia Police Station, the deputy chief's goal is to use this digital crime clock to support investigations and reduce crime rates. Thank you for watching the Patia News. If you appreciate the information we give you each and every day, hey, why not go ahead and follow us? We would appreciate that back.